Now, you talk about guys getting hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Phil, I, I want to get your, your uh, thoughts on this, and Bill as well, because you, you've both been a uh, uh, GM, an assistant GM. Corey Crawford addressing the media, saying that he's out for two to three weeks because he twisted his ankle at a rock concert. Phil, do you read this guy the riot act right now, or, or what, what is going through your mind as, as an executive when your number one goalie says, oh, yeah, yeah I, I screwed up my leg because uh, I went to a rock show last night? Was it Rise Against the Machine? Oh, is that no, Rise uh, Against. Rise Against. I, so didn't, he... I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I, I, I heard him interviewed I, last night, Phil. I thought you might have heard it was on the Chicago station, and the guy said, oh, were you drinking? I don't want to talk about any of that. Well, then and, why did oh, that I, I mean, he, and, and if you go to a rock show and you're 27 years old, I would think you might have a few pops. You might have a little bit of uh, hallucinogenic material to get your mind in the right corner. And then you made a step. You might have had your reading glasses on and fell down the steps. I guess that's what happened. I don't know. Or he was dancing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, my God. No, I was, listen, look. Those were the I'm days, my friend. I yeah. thought they never end. No, if I'm if I'm uh, Did you hear that? general manager, I got him. I got he's good. Yeah. I, if I was the general manager, I would probably would have told him, listen, don't tell anybody. You, tell him you sprained it at home, or something. Yeah. You fell off a curb. Don't tell him you went to a rock concert. Yeah, yeah exactly. Wrong, that, that was an easy cover, unless they went with a bunch of the players. I don't know. Yeah, that's a good point too, Bill. There was a you know, I'd be interested to know, Phil, what does Tony think of Crawford as a goalie? You know what? I've never asked him, but I will. So I tell yeah, him when I, 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 feel, I feel that he's not a problem, but Jesus Christ, he can let some bad goals in. Yeah, that's true. But Ranta played very well last night. For, for yes, yes, he did. Yes, he did. And uh, I think they expect him to play well. They just haven't played him enough to see if he can or not. Well, he's going to be getting his chance now, probably yeah. every game. Mm -hmm. Well, and I uh, well, can't it, believe. I can't believe that he actually said, I went to a rock concert and sprained my ankle. I can't oh, no, that. he was quite honest about it. Yeah. He, didn't, uh, well, he didn't hide it. There's been a lot. I bet you could tell us a few stories, Phil, about guys that uh, had incidents happen off the ice and away from the rink that the truth was not quite there when the uh, public found out what happened. Oh, yeah. <laughs> many, many, many times. But you can't keep it away from anybody anymore. No, you can't. Wasn't there a Toronto Maple Leaf goaltender who was changing curtains at 2 o'clock in the morning and fell through the glass? Remember that story? No. Remember it was Palmateer. Oh, yeah. Was it? <laughs> yep. And it, he wasn't changing curtains, okay? So the story goes there was an incident. Of course. That, you know, but... Yeah, they'll to, to come up with with the most incredible reasons why a player you know has been hurt off the ice is the art of the craft, right? Now